Hello family islanders! Treasure Island has received a major redesign. You can still craft time spheres, accumulate resources and explore. But now there are two islands, new resources and even more gifts. Shaman Myra invites Eva to Forgotten Island in order to send a spirit back to the spirit realm. Myra confesses that her dream said Eva must go alone. Eva agrees and the journey begins. Once you arrive on the island, you'll notice an awesome change. Exclusively for this event so far, Eva will have a brand new look. And it's quite fitting because she'll tackle the whole event on her own. She'll be able to chop down trees, demolish rocks and of course blow things up. Soon after arriving, you'll notice a new resource, clay tablets. You can find clay tablets in almost any resource on the island. You can also find time sphere crystals from almost any resource on the island as well. Both of these resources are really important, but you'll use the Time Sphere crystals and the Time Sphere workshop first. You could create one Time Sphere from 120 Time Sphere crystals. That process takes one hour. Time Spheres are used to power up the Time Fountain on your home island. Once powered up, it gives 40 energy three times. But once it breaks, it only gives five energy. For players that have played Treasure Island before, you aren't forgotten. You may have picked up broken time spheres on the old treasure island. You'll actually be able to use them in this event. Alternatively, to use time sphere crystals, you can use time sphere fragments from the broken spheres of the old treasure islands. Six time sphere fragments makes one time sphere and takes two hours. We recommend making as many time spheres as possible. And if you don't have enough time sphere crystals, don't worry. Just keep on doing the event for more. You'll be expected to light three torches on the way to the end of the island. Each will automatically lift the plate or lower a bridge so that the exploration can continue. On the way, make sure to find helpful resources such as red gifts and blue chests. Red chests will have helpful resources in general such as salt, shells and golden tools. Blue chests will be the best source of clay tablets among other resources. You can also find broken time spheres everywhere which will give you a lot of time sphere crystals. And if you're finding the path a bit crowded, make sure to take advantage of the perfectly placed dynamite on the island. It's both useful and fun. You'll also need to fill several pits on the way. They require resources such as clay, wood, grass, stones, fir cones and clay tablets. Some pits will even reveal areas with a bunch of gifts. This event even has a riddle. You'll be presented with four pits, a riddle and the task of finding an item that will send the spirit back to its realm. The riddle goes, the treasure isn't to the south, the north is cold and blue, dig to the east. Have you already guessed which pit you'll dig up first? Here's a hint, start with the two pits on the right first. Once you find the item, the other three pits will have nothing in them. And if you made it this far into the video, comment east and your support ID on this YouTube video for a free gold shovel to help in this event. As you progress, you'll need to fix some stairs and light three more torches. This will lift the plates and reveal the Altar of Worlds. Place the treasure you dug up on the altar to complete the ritual and send the spirit back to its realm. And as thank you, the spirit will bring you to a second island automatically, Gift Island. There are tons of gifts on the way to the middle and they are all free. But there is another pit to fill and it's incredibly expensive. It'll cost you one tuft of grass. Fill the pit and take home the special flower. Once it's set up on your home island, the family realizes that the base isn't in the best shape. So Eva heads back to the Forgotten Island to repair the last bridge using clay tablets. Past the bridge will be a ton of gifts all for you. Collect them all and then fill the final pit of the event. You can then pick up the base and upgrade your flower on your home island. That concludes the all new treasure island, but your exploration doesn't have to end here. Keep making time spheres and explore the islands for resources and gifts you might have missed. You can even check out the leaderboard to find some additional quests for more prizes and the chance at taking the top leaderboard sport. Did you find this video helpful? Be sure to like, subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you don't miss the latest family island news.